a very warm and happy Teachers' Day to one and all. Today, that is 5th September, is the birth anniversary of Dr. Sarvapalli Radhakrishnan and is celebrated as Teachers' Day as a tribute to his immense contributions to the society. Teaching is one of the main pillars of any nation's education system, which moulds its future. Keeping that aside, Teachers' Day of Independent India has its own effects. Dr. Sarvapalli Radhakrishnan was the first Vice President and the second President of Independent India. He was also a professor, a philosopher and a great politician. He was one of the most distinguished scholars of the 20th century. Dr. Radhakrishnan was the first Indian to hold a professional chair at the University of Oxford and served as a lecturer at Manchester College, Oxford. In 1930, he was appointed Haskell Lecturer in Comparative Religion at the University of Chicago. He has won numerous awards. He was also one of the founders of Help Page India, a non-profit organization for elderly underprivileged in India. In spite of all his achievements and contributions, Radhakrishnan remained a teacher throughout his life. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru once said on Radhakrishnan, he has served his country in many capacities, but above all, he is a great teacher from whom all of us have learned much and will continue to learn. It is India's peculiar privilege to have a great philosopher, a great educationist and a great humanist as her president. In a gathering of prominent figures, Dr. Radhakrishnan expressed his desire to celebrate his birthday as Teacher's Day, paying respect to all the teachers out there who are nurturing the future of our country. How Pandemic Evolved Teaching The COVID-19 pandemic has greatly affected every individual globally. Academics greatly suffered due to this cause, affecting nearly 1.6 billion learners in more than 200 countries. Closures of schools, institutions and other learning spaces have impacted more than 90% of the world's student population. Teachers adept in board work are picking up the way of digital learning, which is the new normal. Different subjects and age groups require different approaches to online learning. Hence, even from students' perspective, things are not easy. Through these hard times, we understood that the nation's education system has to be versatile, adapting to new situations as quickly as possible. In these times of hardship, ed tech industry has actually gained the most popularity. Though platforms providing online courses were present since a long time before the pandemic, but it became popular during the pandemic as people started to understand how these platforms were really beneficial. Evolution of EdTech in India India holds an important place in the global education industry. The country has one of the largest networks of higher education institutions in the world with approximately 260 million students enrolled in greater than 1.5 million schools and 39,000 colleges, primarily dominated by the private sector. According to KPMG's Online Education in India, by this year, the industry's network could end up being around $1.96 billion. This skyrocketed growth has facilitated by the global pandemic that forced online learning to be adopted as an alternative to the traditional ways. One size fits all model does not work anymore. According to former CBSE chairman Ashok Ganguly, the one size fits all theory does not work anymore. 
we must ensure that proper use of technology has happened at every level of education. Videos are the new textbook. The new generation of students is watching courses more than they are reading about it. In past, a single professor could handle at most a batch of 100 students. EdTech enables educators to make themselves available to a huge population of students. The need for a physical space where students and teachers can assemble for classroom sessions is no longer needed. All these factors along with many others fueled the growth of EdTech revolution in India. Now, let us look deeper into a non-profit educational organization, Khan Academy. Khan Academy is an American non-profit educational organization created in 2008 by Salman Khan with the goal of creating a set of online tools that help educate students. Salman Khan is an educator as well as an entrepreneur. The organization produces short lessons in the form of videos. Khan Academy is a non-profit organization mostly funded by donations coming from philanthropic organizations. The popularity of his educational videos on YouTube prompted Khan to quit his job as a financial analyst in late 2009. He moved his focus to developing his YouTube channel Khan Academy, which gained worldwide interest of both students and non-students. Khan published a book about Khan Academy titled One World Schoolhouse, Education Reimagined. Khan Academy, initially a tool for students, added the coach feature in 2012, promoting the connection of the teachers with students through videos and monitor tools. With many such success stories, we can conclude that education system itself has a lot of room for growth with technology being its cornerstone. The pandemic has proven the need for both teachers and learners to be acquainted with the digital learning world and utilize the resources it has to offer to the fullest. Jnana Shakti Samruddha Tadva Mala Bibhushita Bhakti Mukti Pradata Cha Tashmai Shri Gurave Nama With this closing quote, we wish everyone a warm and happy Teacher's Day. Thank you.